If there's something on Netflix, decontamination and transit hub. Do recommend, guys. User alert. Loose contaminants in the decontamination chamber. Access to passenger tramways inadvisable. <laughs> yes, because there's enemies everywhere. That's why it's inadvisable, probably. Oh, hello there. That is a lot of enemies. It's actually only two of them. But I see a lot more red dots. Okay, we could do that. Let's loot the place first. Control group for losing them. They're in. Can't escape. Just couldn't get to the truck. Get out while you can. He must have felt there was no hope of surviving. That killing himself would be easier. All right, I'm guessing this is what we came here. Oh wow, that is difficult. Hold on. Burn, baby! Alright. Another Rachne bites the dust. Oh, hold on. Man, why do these guys keep appearing like this? That is not fair. And somebody's waiting for me on the other side of this door as well. Oh, I was just those green things. Okay. <laughs> Probably shouldn't have wasted my skill there, but oh well. Or start, start with assassination classroom. Jesus. <laughs> the titles alone make me wonder. I think we have arrived. Let me catch up with some chat while we go to the tram. Crunchy roll on your phone, says Subomi. Or on PC, a free anime. Crunchyroll, what is it about? Departing Central Station. Destination, Rift Station. Alright, let's go find out Matriac Bernesia and what she's up to. Yes, we are all men of culture indeed, Subomi. <laughs> now arriving at Rift Station, Binary Helix Research Facility. Alright, no nasty surprises up to now. Let's hope it stays that way. Ah, that's a red door. Cannot go through there. Another red door, so the game is kind of, ki kind of guiding me right now where to go. Where are we going though? Hold on. We are going to Science Station. Okay. Free anime streaming application, says MV. Okay. Oh, hold on, why are these guys? Stand down. Sorry, we couldn't be sure what was on the tram. Can those things work a train's controls? Hell if I know. I'm not assuming any goddamn thing. Look, you're human and that's enough that I won't shoot. But I'd like to know who you are. <laughs> Sunny's still campaigning for me to place uh, Subnautica. You gotta earn that, Sunny. You gotta... I'm gonna put it on a poll, where I'm not gonna put it on poll. You can choose the option other whenever I put the, the next poll up. You can uh, suggest Subnautica. If you get enough people with you, uh, you can, you're gonna force me to play it. <laughs> My name is Shepard. I'm a specter. Huh. I won't look a heavily armed horse in the mouth. The aliens overran the hot labs last week. Only Han Olar got out and he ain't all there anymore. The first we knew the bastards were clawing into my command post. We had a lot more staff then. You know what, Subomi? Actually, Minecraft would be a cool idea to uh, play with you guys. Like, I don't know, maybe when we reach a certain amount of subscribers, we could do a live stream for everybody that could join and play Minecraft together, maybe. But I'm not very good at Minecraft on my own, in survival mode, I mean. So, yeah, that would not be a very fun uh, playthrough for you guys to watch, I bet. <laughs> Watching me get kicked around by all the enemies there. You were taken by surprise and had civilians to protect. You did a good job, Captain. 
Yeah? Sure as hell doesn't feel like it. The board sent an Asari to clean up the mess. She went to the hot labs yesterday. We haven't heard from her since. Yeah, Envy knows it. I do not play much uh, survival, more creative Minecraft. We are building currently. We have built already a few stadiums with my son, like a basketball court and a uh, soccer stadium. And currently we are building an uh, F1 circuit, believe it or not. <laughs> I'm not going to let any of your people die. All I can do is hold out here and protect the civilians. There's an emergency elevator out by the trams. This card will let you activate it. It can take you down to the hot labs. All right, if you need any first aid, Dr. Cohen's downstairs in the med bay. I need to know more about the situation in the hot labs. The facility's off the network. The only way to find out would be to send scouts down the elevator, and I won't send my people to their death. Did the aliens come from inside the facility, or did they attack from outside? You want my personal opinion? Labs like that exist to do stupid crap that gets people killed. Yeah, this guy knows things. Which means, uh, scientists breeded these creatures here, and now they got loose because they're incompetent scientists. Alright, I don't think we need to investigate too much more. Maybe let's ask about Benezia. You're certain the matriarch is still in the hot labs? She hasn't come back here. You came through Central Station, so she ain't there. I've got work to do. Yeah, I hear that. Hell! Man the perimeter! Okay, uh, hold on. Where are the enemies? Liara behind you! Oh, wow. Thanks for the help. Okay. <laughs> Every few hours, a group comes up the tram tunnel. It's actually better since we locked down the elevator. Oh, MV's curiosity is through the roof. <laughs> Well, it actually was kind of a custom track, but it is based off uh, the uh, the Barcelona F1 circuit. I modeled it after after it, but you know, I took some liberties with it, obviously. <laughs> I'll do whatever I can. I don't know why they keep throwing themselves against our defenses. Even animals should learn not to stick their noses where it hurts. All right, then I guess we're good here. Let's save. And let's keep reading our uh, updated log here. Let's see what we need to do. We need to go to the hot labs. Hold on, actually, we could just do that right away. It's right where we came from. Can I go this way? No, that doesn't work. We need to go down then. Let's do that. I always found the uh, Barcelona F1 track very fascinating. I don't know why. I think it's it's kind of a complete track. It has everything. Good straights, good corners. All right, now the hot labs are available. Let's get in on that action. Yes, Catalonia, exactly. I went in my parents' room and you started shooting. They woke up, says Superman. Oh, man. <laughs> Do give your parents my uh, my my condolences. My sorry for that. I know the shooting is extremely loud in this game. Jesus. Are you here to secure the situation? How are you holding up? You must listen to me. If we do not contain our mistake, they will drop bombs from the battle stations. You understand? Oh, Kenzie is asking where the flirting is. <laughs> See, that's why you need to join very early on, Kenz. We did it like in the uh, first 10 minutes of the stream. We flirted with Liara a bit. But uh, stick around, we might flirt with her after this mission is done. We'll see. Wait, is there an Asari matriarch here? Asari? I have not seen one. She is safe then, at Rift Station. Uh, this is not important. You must be listening. Binary Helix found an egg. It was on a derelict ship, thousands of years drifting. This was Rachni's ship. Inside they find many eggs in cryogenic suspension. Oh, so they did find an Rachni egg. The Rachni were supposed to be extinct after the war with the Krogans. Quick uh, reminder, at some point the Rachni uh, was uh, taking over the galaxy. They all but won that war. But uh, the council races decided to ask the Krogans for help. Krogans are these uh, large dudes that you see sometimes. They look like huge lizards. And the Krogans helped. 
and they killed the Rachni for the for uh, for the council, because both the Rachni and the Krogan they can reproduce very rapidly. So the Krogan were the only uh, species that was actually able to mount any kind of defense. In any case, the Rachni seem to be not extinct at all. Rachni, the Krogan wiped them out a thousand years ago. That is so. Billions of lives lost in that war on both sides. Well, that is a good question by MV. Out of the Mass Effect games, which one's your favorite? I'm gonna give you a, co a very controversial answer. Uh, most people like Mass Effect 1 and 2. I like Mass Effect 3 a bit more. Mass Effect 2 is generally the most polished game. Like, and most people will probably tell you Mass Effect 2 is their, their favorite game. But I kind of like the ending of trilogies, like the big reveal at the very end of uh, Mass Effect 3 does it for me. And also the music of Mass Effect 3, man, that kind of brings tears to my eyes, usually when I listen to it. So I don't know, Mass Effect 3 probably, but Mass Effect 2 is a bit better in the quality department. They brought it here to wake it up? Binary Helix planned to clone Rachni, mass produce them, create an army. But when they get here, they find this egg is not a common Rachni, it is a queen. After she lays eggs, they move her to Rift Station. They are thinking that without her, they can raise the babies to be obedient. Hold on. Don't you need a male to get eggs? Queens are born carrying the genetic code of their fathers. Eggs are carried away from the colony to hatch alone. Queens can lay eggs in hours and have a colony in days. This is how they spread so quickly. Separating them from their mother didn't work. Ah, this was exactly the wrong thing to do. I am thinking that without a queen, Rachni do not develop properly. Her mind is shaping theirs. These Rachni are uncontrollable. Alright, so this is an important piece of lore actually about the Mass Effect universe. The Rachni, they do reproduce very quickly, but they have to be very close to their queen. Otherwise, they do uh, lose focus. Like, Rachni children, it's not like talking, it's kind of a weird part of the lore, I don't know how exactly to explain it, but it's not like humans, where you uh, educate them slowly over time. Rachni soldiers have to be very close to the queen as they're born. Otherwise, you cannot teach them later on in their life anything. They learn everything they do learn in like those first minutes or so. So if you separate them from the queen, they become uncontrollable forever and you cannot do anything about it. Then all we need to do is bring her here. No, I am sorry, but this will not work. These Rachni are beyond saving. It is a sad thing, but they must be euthanized. Uh, I am thinking that the Neutron Purge must be set off. Okay, Subomi, thanks for stopping by, mate. And what about Mass Effect Andromeda, asks MV. Well, it was uh, a bit lower quality. It was, You know what? I'm not gonna reward EA for Mass Effect Andromeda. I did like the game, but they did put such a low effort into it. I mean, if you guys haven't seen Mass Effect Andromeda memes, you're in for a ride. Like, <laughs> there is a very famous meme of Mass Effect Andromeda. Like, I don't remember exactly what it is, but it is, I think it's, uh, if you Google, my face is tired. Mass Effect Andromeda. You're gonna come up with the most famous meme of that game, which is very funny. I'm not familiar with the purge system. It creates bursts of neutron radiation, kills everything within the station. Things beyond get genetic damage of varying degree. How do we set off the purge? Arming controls are nearby. All you do is insert the key. Then I will get near at the start. Uh oh! Plot twist! He was about to give us a code, but the Rachni would have none of this. Damn, you Rachni! Okay, thankfully it was only one Rachni, so we can deal with that. Let's obtain the purge codes though. And let's go kill the rest of the Rachni soldiers, I guess. Ah yes, I remember this terminal. Connecting. I have full access to the facility and am at your disposal. 
It's the Ragni and lobsters that can see. <laughs> well, it looks uh, half half Ragni, half spider, and half crustacean. I don't know. <laughs> is there an Asari here? There is an Asari I cannot identify standing next to you. Well, duh. How you tolerate literal minded VIs is beyond me. <laughs> yeah, exactly. There are no others visible to my remaining internal sensors. I don't know about eating the Ragni, Kenzie. There might be some toxic stuff in that. Well, if you like your food spicy, though, <laughs> I don't know. How many Rachni are in here? I'm sorry. The sensor network is too damaged to provide an accurate count. No, everybody knows what I'm talking about. All right, let's... uh. Give me your best guess. Guessing is beyond my design parameters, Commander. I guess let's go ahead and kill those Rachni. Activate the Neutron Purge. I'm sorry, but I can't do that without proper code authorization. Code input 875-020-079. Code Omega, local execution. Verify. Code Omega execution in 120 seconds. Oh man, eating a pufferfish sounds terrifying, Kent. <laughs> okay, now we need to uh, deal with a lot of enemies here. Uh, we need to kill these guys off quickly because there's a timer right now and there's so many of them hold on are my oh my partners are dead let's revive everybody give me some adrenaline oh that didn't work Ouch, Jesus. Well, I bet this sequence blew your ears out. I'm sorry. Are there more enemies here? Still one remaining. Jesus, that is loud. <laughs> Are we done? All right, let's get out of here. We only have 30 seconds. Go. Run. Get out of the blast zone. All right, and think we're safe. And boom goes the lads. And the Rachni are no more. Excellent. Now let's focus on finding Benezia, which is... That's the wrong way to go. Hold on. Let's go back to the colony. Now that we've dealt with their little problem, hopefully they're going to be more friendly. Point us towards Benezia. Sunny with a big brain. Says MV. Man, I would be terrified of... Eating puffer fish, though. <laughs> I will kind of get nightmares of it expanding in my mouth as I eat it. I don't know. Can we do something here? No. Let's keep going. I'm sorry about this, Shepard. We've got orders from Venezia. Are you oh, traitor? Yeah. You betrayed us. I helped you. This is how you repay me. All right, we need to get out of the blast zone. You two line up here. Give me some shields. And then we're gonna snipe the hell out of them. Oh, Jesus, that guy pucks a punch. Hold on, let me regain shields here a bit. Probably go in with my rifle instead this time. Oh, I'm kind of cheesing this fight. <laughs> I can hit them, but they cannot hit me. Oh, 
Oh, this guy's hiding. Oh, wow, okay. Shoot. I'm almost dead. Oh, wow, okay. I think we're gonna die. My teammates are currently locked out. That is not going well. And my weapons are overheating. Yeah, we're dead. We're dead. I need adrenaline now. No. Run. Run back quickly. Like a coward. <laughs> Why aren't you helping me, girls? Come on. Jesus. Uh, let me get some healing here. Wow, we almost died. Die, you bastard. Alright, let's get that Turian. Man, they just circled me. I see your head. <laughs> bye bye. Oh man, thank god I had the right combination of skills there. Oh Jesus. Okay, okay. Hold on. Let's talk about this. Okay, I think we're in the clear. And we just need to kill those drones. I'm just gonna shoot its leg. <laughs> I found the cheese again. Uh, let's see what you guys are saying. Top 10 anime betrayals. Interesting. Nightmares, says Sunny D of rats deep frying themselves in my kitchen. <laughs> That's so weird indeed. Alright, hold on. Can we save? Man, I cannot save. Yeah, I guess we have to uh, be careful not to lose this battle. One down. Oh wow, she's very close. I should probably get out my rifle. the insanity difficulty you really have to use cover like all the time so that enemies cannot even shoot at you because if they do and they hit you you can go down very quick oh hold on still two enemies waiting for me on the other side there okay The best thing about having teammates in this game is that the enemies focus their fire on them. And leave me alone. Alright, one more. And we are out of here. Oh, two more actually. Oh shoot, hold on. Could actually use the sniper rifle here. hit his hair. <laughs> that was a hair shot, not a head shot. And I think that's the last of them. Can I please save? Thankfully. Uh, let's see. That is a sad state of affairs. What are you guys talking about? We were so close to the dad joke like three minutes ago. <laughs> no, you weren't. You weren't. I kept my end of the deal, guys. 
I gave you a dad joke. We didn't say anything about original dad jokes. <laughs> Alright, let's go find that matriarch. The Ardazer sexy moves again. 